I'm just on an incredibly long taxi journey to uh, Mobile. Um, I was going to get a buzz, <coughs> but it was going to take way too long, so I agreed a price with the driver. I'm paying about £30 to drive three hours, maybe even longer. I was going to get the buzz, it was going to take like six hours, and this is already long enough. So I've cut my losses and I'm going to Mobile. Yay! So me and a group of friends from the hostel went to look for some turtles because turtle sightings are very popular in mobile and after about an hour, maybe two hours of nothing, I was swimming back to shore and I came across a turtle and it was absolutely incredible. This morning, well today, I'm going canyoning at Kawasan Falls. Um, it looks absolutely amazing and I can't wait to do it. I've never been canyoning, canyoning or canyoneering, I think it's the same thing. Um, I'm so excited, let's go. Canyoning. I'm looking a little bit dishevelled. Uh, oh my god, it was so good. Um, I'm so glad that I did it. Um, the only jump that I didn't do was the last one, and it's because they mentioned that someone from Korea died doing it the week before. She had a heart condition, that's why, but it definitely put me off. Um, but it was so good. It was only 500 pesos, pesos, pesos. Um, which is about 22 23 pounds the actual tour the guides the equipment so yeah to have a helmet and uh, shoes and everything uh, what else lunch transport there transport back so it, it was really good it was definitely worth doing i'm so glad that i did it the scenery was amazing the jumps just doing the jumps it's a must do if you come to mobile Today 
um, I've opted for a local Filipino beach over a tourist beach. It's so nice. I think I'm the only non-Asian person here, which is quite nice. Yeah, it, it's really weird. Like they have karaoke all day, all through the day. At 11 a.m. when I got here, karaoke was going. Um, I got a little bit lost as well getting here, and one of the locals got me to follow him on a motorbike. Um, the people here are just so nice, they're so friendly. Uh, this is Ludbug Beach, Lumbug Beach, I think. I'm just making my way to Mount Pella Falls, but I have no internet and the signs are really really bad or non-existent so maybe we'll make it maybe we won't and the weather looks like it's turning for the worst maybe it'll pass but we'll see how we go this is my little scooter I just wanted to end the video with a little story. So basically when I was on my way to Montpella Falls I reached a house that had the sign for Montpella Falls outside and there was a little girl playing in the garden and when I asked if I could park my bike there and go down to the falls the family was saying oh yeah like you can you two can go together and I was really really wary because I didn't know these people and these people didn't know me and along the way we met our auntie and they were so nice, they were so hospitable, uh, they were so friendly even though you know we didn't know each other. Um, they didn't speak much English but we managed to communicate and yeah that is just the hospitality of the Philippines that I wanted to show everyone.